of a sudden we start seeing um, a, a decline in various equity equities markets, and all of a sudden they're losing money in certain other areas. So they might pull pump the brakes a little bit and say, okay, well, let's be a little bit more strategic. Let's focus on this value and value creation aspect of it, as opposed to let's just do a land grab and get as much as we possibly can, right? Exactly. Uh, and we'll see this in real estate too, when all of a sudden, you know, we're like right now we're in a higher interest rate economy for, uh, especially for the, the real estate, the mortgages. And so we're seeing these companies that are just sitting on a pile of cash are making, they're still making astronomical offers on properties just because no one else can get it. And so they're going in and they're just doing a land grab and they're getting it for what they would consider a steal because the values have come down a little bit compared to what they were maybe in 2020, 21. But yeah, as a result of just having so much money available, that's already, you know, earning them less than what they want. They're able to go in there and they're just willing to throw money after the problem. Right. Wow. So from an entrepreneur's perspective, it, it can be very, very challenging to figure out which way to go down. Right. 